menghadirkan mom. Deep within, here we go. What's up, you guys? It's another day, another vlog. It's a Friday and it's my day off, so it's morning i just got mikaya ready for school i'm about to drop her off my husband is already out it's 8 a.m right now mikaya will be having her midterm break today and they will also be having a harvest celebration and because of that they ask them to bring any tin or canned food so that they can take it to the food bank for people who need it and i just thought to take this this is Abigail's formula. This is the formula she used to take. Just before she turned two, she stopped taking it completely. I tried everything possible to get her to drink this formula. She stopped taking it just about one week before she turned two. So I have this container left. I'll be sending that to Mikaya's school for the harvest celebration. And also this farm grown potatoes in water yes because nobody actually is going to eat this and it expires on the 12th of 2021 that's december 2021 so this is october there's still some time before it expires since abigail started daycare she has been coming back with all sorts of complaints she started with um blisters in the mouth blisters on her lips and i consulted they gave me some prescription for her she took those and she has been fine and after that it was uh, conjunctivitis they prescribed some eye ointment for her she has been taking those and she seems all right now but last night she really came up with some very high temperature this morning we have not slept all night honestly she's here in her pram waiting and she's just not having it i'll be spending the day with her I'm really just monitoring her if the temperature does not go down by midday i'll have to call her gp again to see what i can get for her did i say hello guys i don't remember saying that anyways i hope you all are doing well if you are new here hi you are welcome my name is jose i'm a cameronian based in the uk on this channel i do food family and lifestyle vlogs and i chat about very relatable topics if this sounds like something you're interested in kindly consider subscribing and do not forget to turn on the notification bell if you'd like to be notified each time i upload a new video right guys it's time to take mikaya to school before we run late let me get going i'll see you guys in a bit Mikaya is going to school today in her clothes because apparently her school is celebrating Halloween which is not our cup of tea because we don't celebrate Halloween but the rest of them who don't celebrate Halloween are allowed to come in assorted way I don't think anyone else in my class doesn't celebrate Halloween So are you going to be the only one left out? <laughs> oh. How do you feel about that? Uh, I just realized something. Daddy is a Christian and his name is Christian. Or yes. Or Chris. Yes. Wow, so amazing. This is what I look like wearing a simple two piece with my long black coat. Yeah, um, give us a spin. Google. Give Google. us the spin. With my favorite. Oh, give us the spin. Yay. With my favorite <laughs> Nike walking shoes which has helped me for over two years now super comfortable all right we are just close to mikaya's school now we're just waiting for her doors to open mm. so i can take her in and go back home and continue my day's activities <sighs> so guys abigail and i are back home today's weather is one of those weathers where you just want to stay indoors and cozy up honestly we've just dropped mikaya off at school and i had to ask her teacher about the halloween thing because i was feeling somehow for mikaya even though we've explained to her why we don't celebrate halloween i feel as though she does not really understand especially when she's the only one in her class as she told me that she is going to be the only one in her class who does not celebrate halloween i need 
needed to ask her teacher to make sure that they make her comfortable if they are going to be having any Halloween party. But she told me that they are not having any party at all. They just asked the kids to dress up uh, in their costume for the harvest celebration. And that is that, that they are going to have a normal school day, which is reassuring for me. I need to edit my video. I'm sure by the time you guys are watching this vlog, that video will be up already. So check it out. In that video, I talked about things that spouses need to consider discussing before bringing their other half from Africa if you've not watched it check it out you might just need it or you might know someone who needs it so that you can share it with them it's currently 9 a.m. and Abigail is still running a temperature I need to give her some paracet syrup and monitor how she feels by midday or so if she doesn't get well if her temperature does not go back to normal then I'll have to call her GP my poor baby Abigail <coughs> You'll be alright, okay, mama? You'll be just fine, okay? Yeah? You can do something else, okay? Come on, let's go upstairs. Falling stars, but still I see you, sweet. Oh, no! What's up guys it's the next day i ended up calling abigail's gp and all they did was prescribe some carpal for her which i already have at home so i gave her that in the afternoon yesterday i gave her again in the evening and this morning she woke up feeling a lot better as you guys can hear she's playing she's chatting and i'm a bit at peace right now because she seems all right you know when when a child is sick it affects the mother it affects anybody who cares about her because the child cannot really express exactly how they are feeling yeah it's a bit disturbing but she's all right this morning it's uh, almost midday i'm about to go to the shop i need to get some chicken because tomorrow i need to make some rice and chicken to take to a family who lost somebody i need to pay them that condolence visit tomorrow so i need to get everything set so that when I wake up, I will not have much to do. Mikaya and her dad are out. It's a Saturday. They've gone to the warehouse and Abigail and I are here. I cannot take her to the warehouse because I will not be able to do anything at all. So we are here doing other things while Mikaya and her dad. Mikaya is on half term break as I think I mentioned that earlier. For some reason, she prefers spending time with her dad than me because I'm that strict mom. And her dad is a bit... Mm, let her have her way sometimes not all the time though so she prefers to spend time with her dad rather than spending time with me because i am that strict african mom i hope you are enjoying this laid back vlog so far if you are like the video and if you've not yet subscribed to this channel please consider subscribing for more videos like this i'll probably see you guys when i'm up to something interesting all right oh you died <laughs> Okay, so we know, we know we're so much to make to about these things. Yay! Okay, that's a very scary trick. That was a good idea. Okay, this guy, aka okay, hey, Kevin, Mr. Chicken, is going back in! So, do you want to get that backside? What is right, Carl? Is not for us? Guys, I just ran into this. I found it really interesting and I wanted to show you guys. I hope you enjoy watching it.
Here we go! Boys coming in hot! Please stand by the cross in your face, Josh! Dan! Aaron! Aaron! Is that okay? Is that okay? Is that a good finish? Okay, don't put that. But for the rest of you, Manchester Nation guys, for our Lego City Scots Restart Red Cross crew, the Birdtail boys back in town. Thank you so much, Manchester, for making our very first day of this tour an incredible one. You guys making noise like that is very much appreciated, very much needed. Thank you, thank you, thank you. But that is a wrap as far as the action is concerned. But if you'd like to come and meet our riders, please come and hang out on this side of the arena. Random jobs. <laughs> I thought I heard London jobs. I was about to say, hey, did you guys travel to London? So, did you guys spend most of the time in the warehouse or out of the warehouse? Most of the time in the warehouse. Abby. That's nice. Did you enjoy it? Hello, Abigail. Did you enjoy your time there? Yes. Will you be going back to the warehouse more often? Daddy. Yes. Yes. Daddy. Oh. Yes. <laughs> She always says puppy. <laughs> puppy. Puppy, as you say, mommy. Am I your puppy? <laughs> <laughs> puppy Am I your puppy? Puppy. Puppy. puppy? puppy. Am I your puppy? Happy guys, did you miss them? She always says that. Mm. Puppy. Daddy. Mm. You guys are doing group hug without me. I can't even really show myself. Mm. What did you eat? Pizza. You guys left the house with no food. Pizza. Pizza. No, we, uh, we, I made a sandwich. We left the house with a sandwich? Yes. Alright. Did you see Uncle Awa? Yes. And he gave me money and I bought something. Uncle Awa is always touching you money. I spent two pounds steady. Just two. So where's the change? Spend and then she borrowed me. If you spend two pounds, she you're supposed to have three pounds left. For three pounds. When are you supposed to give her back? So you'll be making 50p in 12 hours or 24 hours? You are going to make 50p on top of your £2.50 within 24 hours. Because your dad has, your dad has borrowed your £2.50 and he says he's supposed to give back £3. I like how I, was, I wasn't even the one guy doing work and now I'm going to get money. <laughs> you didn't do work. Yeah. I, I only helped. I only helped. But I really even helped. You learn by helping and by watching, right? Yeah. Nice. That's great. Yeah, everything. Okay. We have to clean up everything because we have to redo the room. Guys, so... I don't know if you guys watched our new bathroom creation video this is where the bathroom used to be and uh, what are you trying to transform this into it's gonna be um, like a tv room for the kids and a storage okay. so that's a playroom playroom and a storage yeah and what again that's it and it's st st study as well no wardrobe that's wardrobe, that's, that's storage, isn't it? No, it's storage. So on this side, we're going to have some shelves where we can fold and keep our clothes. 
and down here is going to be a TV and study room. Right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, TV and study room Wait. for the kids. Uh, it's good. We're gonna try and put a um, here. Mm -hmm. Oh, big girl, come. Sofa bed. Come, mama. Come. Come, baby. Daddy, let me show you. Let me show you. See? This is it. See? This, this one. This one goes here. It goes here. It goes here. See? See? In there. And then this one goes here. So Abigail is playing her puzzle and when she does not get one right, she gets really frustrated. Yeah. Yay. Good job Abigail. <laughs> well done. Yay. Well done, Mama. <laughs> well done, Abby. See that? Yep. Fitting the elephant. Good job. Well done, Abigail. Well done, you've completed. Well done, Mika. Good job, Mama. You've been working all day. You are making good use of your midterm break. Good job, guys. It's already evening and everyone is tired and i think i will just end this vlog here thank you so much for watching if you totally enjoyed watching like the video subscribe to the channel for more videos like this one stay blessed stay safe continue to drink a lot of water and mind the business that pays you i'll see you in my next one bye happy guys say bye